I'm gonna come and murder this guy. Okay, I downed one, but his buddy got me. Finish him! I murdered him! Oh, what's up, bitches? You just got done! You just got done! Guess what? You are now a clip! Yeah. I hope you're feeling better. That is the cure to fucking COVID. I'm being dead ass, okay? Kayla, you gotta think of yourself and taste yourself. There is your cure. I got you. What the fuck? Finger yourself and taste yourself, she says, is the cure to COVID. Stop it. Get some help. All right. Sure. I'm gonna call that fake news, but that's just me. I'm only punching him. Yes! Yes! Reach out and touch me! Oh! Yeah! <laughs> that was awesome. Woman is getting married to her, her love, but they've both been married before, right? And this is this is in the 1800s, so this is a rarity, right? And the woman says to her mom, she goes, "You know, I'm a little loose down there." And her mom goes, "Well, you know." And, there's something you can do. I, I know you want to be, you know, you want to be great for your new husband. And uh, so her, her mom goes, what, what you should do is you should put some, uh, some liverwurst in there. Put some liverwurst in there. He'll never know the difference. And so they get married and they, they consummate their marriage. And they're just going at it all night long. I mean, going at it, uh, making love, you know, they're in love. And, uh, uh, they, they wake up in the morning and, and the man's gone and the woman looks around and the man's gone but there's this note and the man says I've gone out to fetch us breakfast and I've never loved anyone so much as I love you and I am so glad that we were able to find each other after um, you know after being married once before but now that we found each other I feel like this is this is real and I've never loved anybody the way I love you PS your cunts in the sink <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, they're gassed in there, dude. <laughs> Down. Nice. Oh shit! Oh shit! Eliminated. <laughs> nice. <laughs> now that is teamwork, ladies and gentlemen. That is teamwork, everybody. I downed him with a precision airstrike. That was fun. I got lucky. Yeah, team wipe all at the same time. I got wicked lucky, man. You worked in a condom factory? Wow. That is the most fun uh, answer we've gotten thus far. A condom factory. Holy shit. All right. What was that like? Only for two weeks and you were 16? Dude, what, what did your friend say? Yo, hey, Retro, you worked in a condom factory for two weeks when you were uh, 16. Did your friends give you a good ribbing for it? Adjust some settings up. Gotcha, bitch! Oh, I killed somebody. I'm rich! I'm rich, Bianch! Thank you, Grumpy! Oh, shit! Thank you, Jesus, Grumpy, thank you! Oh my gosh, Grumpy, thank you so much, man! That's called Bid Yeah! Yeah, thank you, man. Thank you. Anything that you could get at 35 different places on Microsoft Campus. Jesus Christ, you just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh, I just killed everybody. Oh, my yes. God. I well just done. killed everybody. I've thrown everything at it. Yes. 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 Double kill. All right, Pritchard Ives, congratulations. You won yourself a day. Oh, yeah. Logan Radio Rocks is cleaning up Twitch one ass at a time. And the first lock.
Bucks, 120 self-cleaning bidet goes to Pritchard Eyes. I'm gonna change your life! I killed some people. So yeah, you did. Gotcha, bitch! That one's dead too. Three ways I know I was getting old. There have been times when I, I have left the house and then looked in the mirror and thought, I forgot to shave my ears today. Yeah. When I was listening to EDM music and realized that it was just video game noises with beats behind it. And as the third way that I knew I was getting old, well, when it took me about a year and a half to realize that the new drug bath salts wasn't something you could go and purchase at Bed Bath & Beyond. Yeah, it's true, it's true. This is what I'm missing on my stream. Glow sticks and boobs. Glow sticks and boobs. Oh, did she just get self-conscious because she heard me go glow sticks and boobs and she's like I'm not trying to show my boobs. Oh, let me just stretch out a little bit. I'm not trying at all to show my boobs off. No, I'm not at all Yeah, she's sticking her tongue out on purpose. I do it for aim Oh, yeah, get him. Oh, yeah, pump it up. Pump it up. Oh, 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 yo Oh, ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, welcome to Ruby XX. And if you want a champagne room, just grab Ruby X and get to their OnlyFans. OnlyFans.com slash Ruby XX. That's double X's, not triple X's. Double. <laughs> Her cleavage is quality, though. When I did my stand-up routine, I had a joke about sucking your own dick. And and how and how and how it's not a sin if <laughs> if you could suck your own dick and you swallowed because then your seat isn't touching the ground. Yes, if a man could suck their dick, they would never leave the house. That's how the joke starts, stoner girl. That's how the joke starts. It goes, raise your hand if you've ever tried to suck your own dick. You know what? Don't raise your hand because I know every single guy in this audience has tried. Now raise your hand if you succeeded. You know what? Don't even bother because if you could suck your own dick, guess what? You'd be at home sucking your own dick. Well, and if you could suck your own dick, all right, so Carney says he wouldn't, but if you could suck your own dick, would you swallow or spit? <laughs> and if you did swallow, doesn't that make it, re it doesn't make it, you know, it's recycling, baby. I'm just saying. It's very green, very green. There we go, there we go. I just put an airstrike on where they're moving to. Everybody watch out. Oh, it's Team White. Chuck destroyed. Oh my God, I didn't see any of it happen, but it was absolutely amazing.